Hi all, welcome to today's market opening report and hope you have enjoyed your weekend and I have enjoyed a lot and <laughs> looking at where the market is, so the way, the day we have left off on the Friday, so seems to be like market was bullish and if you look at institutional data point of view, uh, even I was expecting uh, needs to be some kind of net inflow but uh, surprisingly that there is no inflow so it's only a flat so all together FIA and DIA together so it was something like very flat so from option data point of view yes the data is very strong even today data is very strong so you need to take care of like if you are going short here uh, ensure that uh, only the risk reward will be favor for you in case if you are going to short here and ensure that the data is not with you maybe uh, at the end of the day or mid of the day you may get a clar clarity about uh, where the data is strong or not but looking at uh, where is nifty at so nifty is uh, if you look at nifty so nifty is at 16 almost 300 level so 290 to 300 level whereas bank nifty is somewhere around 35 34 550 level so what i feel is like uh, the supply zones are very closer so even uh, this place is like you, you can nifty we can need to watch for 16 350 to 400 levels so going long here may not yield you big but only thing is whether you wanted to short here or wait for the short is the only key reason like we need to look into the market and moreover wix if you look at wix is up for the day though market is uh, trying to inch up but wix is slightly up and moreover this weekend news of uh, the petrol uh, kind of discount they have given the government has announced some kind of excise duty cut because of that petrol and diesel rates were reduced and moreover many announcements were done uh, for uh, <coughs> the gas subsidy all those things but looking at that market seems to be like slightly bullish but yes data is also bullish but if you look at the structure wise I feel uh, market can just take a stop in another one or two days that's what I feel because I do not want to like take long here I am sl slightly initiating my uh, positional shots but with kind of risk reward in favor so that is what I wanted to have today's uh, uh, view as a today's view so I just wanted to ensure that if market is going further uh, look for data so that is what I am looking for because I wanted to short go heavy but waiting for option data to show me some kind of int so that I can short otherwise I just wait for uh, slowly reducing like increasing my positions when I see the data point of view so when you look at the option data point of view you will get a clear idea about when this uh, move is going to stall so at that point I might be initiating a, a little larger positions but around this place so these places I am not going to long here I have just started my shots initially okay so there it can it can give another 300 to 400 point rally in bank nifty also but uh, looking at the data point of view we can uh, think about it whether to uh, short that or wait and let's price come to the exact uh, supply zone so supply zone is somewhere around 34 650 okay that is a zone even uh, if you look at uh, if you are listening to our last three to uh, four weeks regular uh, updates about the market that zone is a very key zone and for moreover for nifty it is 16 400 so 350 to 400 16 350 to 400 is a key level and for the bank nifty it seems to be like 34 650 to that 800 to 800 so 150 point zone is the key resistance level if you look at that is a place where market has reacted heavily in the last two three weeks so i am just trying to uh, bet on those level yes data was not turning bearish but uh, price wise structure wise it seems to be like the market has run more okay on a shorter time frame the rally has come in so the rally is I think it is going to take a pass but I expect it to take a pass around the important swing zone so that swing zone I am expecting to take a resistance and maybe the higher time frame play of bearishness may come in so that's what my style of trade for the next two to three days this is what I want you to uh, make note of it and moreover the India VIX is the key 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 term which you need to look in because uh, as the market is also going up the India VIX is still up for the day for 2% and it is trading around 23 point almost 23.58 so that means what any swing could be wild and furious this is what it says it need not to be like on the direction of your prediction so you need to be always taking care if you are long ensure that market can give a huge dip and in the same way if you are short ensure that market can give a rise it's very short and like frugal uh, moves it can make because of the 
India weeks. This is what you need to take care. And moreover, this is the last week of monthly expiry. So I've been repeating many times from last uh, three, four days. This is the key factor. Like people needs to be like little worried upon. Even though if you're long or short, ensure that you have a very tight mechanism of risk in the process of your trading that's what is going to save you uh, because if you look at all the social media and moreover uh, uh, in kind of uh, all these uh, youtube platforms people are saying this last two three weeks uh, were very 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 difficult for traders to maintain and many people have lost their capital also it is mainly because of the not only the market moves based on the it is also based on the India weeks that means volatility see volatility is the key it is not the direction actually people are trying to predict the direction good but only thing was the whipsaws are getting huge in the wrong direction that is actually the clear clear statement uh, like what uh, these kinds are people are making from the last two to three weeks uh, if you look at uh, just an observer in a social media or in a kind of YouTube platform so I, I, I want you people to again be aware of all those things and then take the view accordingly so I hope you enjoyed watching this video let's catch up in the evening for the post market analysis thank you for watching